Hey GTI fans, welcome back to another episode of Imperial Galactic Survival. This is your host Zlot. Uh, we're currently on Alpha 7, the release candidate 1. And uh, this is episode 20 of my Alpha 7 experimental season 1. Uh, I, I'm going to have another... <clears throat> series coming up pretty quick based on my multiplayer server start and uh, so I want to finish this one up with just to do a couple of things where where we were shy getting some resources and I was going to take the SV out here smash the just just take the turrets out so that we don't get shot to get this cobalt which we desperately need now because I only have I currently have 330 or 330 missiles that should take out be enough to take out all the turrets. I don't think I got any on this, do I? No, just 15 mil. So yeah, wow. Uh, that's it for our co cobalt. We're we're done. Uh, I ran my resources dry on my on my ammo. <coughs> Excuse me. So cobalt starts becoming a an issue. Arrestrium, a huge thing. Wow, I I I can't believe I've like grinded through like twenty thousand arrestrium now, uh, producing ammo and these three vehicles, <laughs> three vehicles, and that would have been that would have been I don't know a couple thousand before maybe. So I guess. That's how they're balancing it now, because the ammo really eats up a lot. And so do vehicles now. I mean, like 10 times more. <coughs> Excuse me, i got a bit of a throg in my throat. <coughs> um, okay, so today, let's jump into the SV and go kill. Or, you know, let's jump into the SV and go try not to die. Well, I try to kill. Uh, actually, I won't even need. I can just jump right in. I don't need to go through my o OCT. Okay. Uh, let's. Should I? No. We should be okay. We should be okay. I think I got. Yeah, I got canned veggies on me and lots of power. Okay. Let's just do this. Let's just do it. Let's just do it. Whoa! And yeah, see when you uh, when you raise up underneath something <laughs> in uh, half gravity, you can go really fast, really quick. Okay, so where was this guy again? That was all face. I'm facing it, aren't I? Yes, I am. So let's, so there he is there. So, oh, do I not have my O2 going here? Hang on, hang on. There we go. Can I turn lights on? Eh, I don't think it matters, I might be. Okay, so this is without night vision. This is with night vision. Whoa, I can't see it with... Okay, so, without... So, yeah, let's turn the lights on. Okay, so, I like to get really, really on top of these things because then their turrets have a real tough time. So... Kind of thinking the four corners, right? So let's take a look at uh, and if that's the case. So three something, okay, three fifty, three. Oh shit! See, see what happens when you uh, don't follow your own uh, rules by uh, loading. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. 
yes, I just did that. Okay, let's try this again. So now they're all ready for me, and uh, <sighs> stupid, stupid, stupid. And, and I did not kill it. Damn it! Okay, still didn't kill it. Okay, that's uh. <laughs> Damn, well that is a turret, and they can shoot straight up for some reason, so screw them. Did I kill him? Are you serious here? Holy crap. <laughs> okay, okay, super duper tough. I am on hard mode, I know, but come on. Kill him! God damn it! Oh wait, that's it's these guys shooting there. Is that it? Oh god. See, see, now if I just look at what was actually shooting at me. There we go. So, so I still hit it at quite the range by the look of it. So I'm wondering if. Yeah, okay, okay. So is that it then? Is that it? Did I finish derping and uh, trying to kill a tower? Uh, a piece of. Metal? Oh my god, Zelot. He needs to die just to get my frustrations out. But I don't want to really use up the rest of my good ammo. The stuff I need cobalt for. And yeah, I did it again. See, there we go. That's okay. These guys go down like nothing. Scythe's cutting th through straw. Okay. Uh, let's see if there's any shooty guys. Oh yeah, 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 there's shooty guys. There's shooty guys. There's definitely shooty guys. Okay, so let's switch to here. And we're, it was right around, right? Somewhere out. Shooty guys? Huh? Shooty guys? No? Uh, okay, well, let's check it out. So nothing shooting at me. Okay. So, okay. Okay. So there's the deposit right over there. Let's see. Get real close. Shooty guys, shooty guys. Huh? Exposing my ass to you. That's really... Oh, see, and that, that was brilliant. Yeah, see, because there are shooty guys. <sighs> okay. <laughs> oh, 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 where are you? Oh, I see ya, I see ya. So you're coming from right, like... Right? Turrets up front. Okay, I think I can get to this now. Without it shooting. Let's see. Yep. 
Okay. Let's uh let's go get the the HV. It's it's much better at this than hand mining it. It's safer too because it it'll uh it'll auto defend itself with its turrets, so Let's just park this thing. Come on, open. Thank you. And straighten out. And figure out where am I here? Okay, so let's just move forward a little bit. a little bit and yeah, we'll just you know so the next time when I jump in and power it up I'll smash into the thing again okay so let's, oh yes whatever I lose an oxygen every time because I forget to turn my oxygen off or something I guess I don't, I'm not sure so I can actually have quite a few people in here with me three <laughs> uh, okay so let's get this going what are we at for ammo 1900 we're fine let's just let's just get this get this ore the CV can protect itself as it has been there's some silicone there too but I don't really care about that let's just get this cobalt Okay, good. My turrets aren't going to freak out at it. No? No? Okay, good. And you can see the ore scanner reveals because I, I have, I'm on the drill mode on my HV. I can actually see the deposits like in, uh, in hand mode. It's the same, same thing. So I just want to make a spot. Oh, there's one already revealed. And eat. And that was worth 75 right there. Oh, I've already gotten a couple others too. So, yeah, you can see I'm just trying to actually make a spot for this piece. And I've already gotten a bunch. Okay, so... The unfortunate thing about this is you get a lot of crushed stone, like way more than what you can ever do, it's really. Okay. So, I got it. I see a nugget right there in front of me, but I'm having some issues getting it because I kind of, oh no, there I got it. So the T1 wouldn't have been able to do that, it would have just got hung up on it. See, I just got to barely touch it with one of these and, it, and it's able to actually mine it properly. Okay, so come on. Right, upside down here. Oh, I gotta hit out. Yeah. It'll eventually wiggle its way out. For some reason it's not giving me... Okay, so <laughs> that's why I gotta make myself a bit of a something to jump out of. There we go. Okay. 
So that was some there. Looks like 38% uh, of it. So we're not. Unfortunately, you gotta make a bit of a hole with a with an HV. So it's it's kind of clumsy compared to what it used to be. Like man, land, or sorry, hand mining. Do almost as fast a job. Well, maybe this thing this thing eats them really fast. Come on, you're right there. Come on. Oh, what is that? A drone coming in? There's a drone coming in. Great. So let's get out of here. So is that a replacement drone or I wonder what's going on there? Is that like the troop transport or something? I didn't see a sign that there was a troop transport coming, so... No, it's just a minigun drone. Oh, and there's another one too. Wow. Oh, look at that! It's after me right away. And do I have my turrets off? Because they were doing nothing. <laughs> So, they want a piece of me. It's okay, I got enough bullets on me. I can just take care of them with my regular guns here. Until I look to see what the hell is going on with my turrets. Okay. So, what is going on here? Uh, okay. Well, that could be an issue. And, uh, okay, 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 okay. Let's stop that shit. Yeah. Um, that stuff. Don't want it to do those things. Why are you firing? I thought I had that set. Oh, there's turrets and crap in there then. Hmm. Okay, so let's just turn that off for now because I still want these active. So let's just. Because then it'll still fire at drones. And these guys. Uh, I don't even have rockets for them, so I don't have to worry about it. Okay. Okay. So. Are they done coming at me? Okay. Okay. See how fast it is to dig with one of these things too. With six freaking lasers on it. Oh, expose some nuggets right there. Okay. So let's have those, get those cleaned up. Looks like I was going a little too deep there. Burks. Oh. What's going on here? Come on. Stop there. Come on. Okay. Hit O then. It's, I must be stuck on something above me. Yeah, there we go. It jostled out of it. And those little, these tiny little things of, of dirt, they actually can prevent me from moving. <laughs> Stuff like that, that's like, ah, uh, damn. I don't know why I'm stuck, and I can't even get it. I can't even get them. <sighs> okay. There are nuggets. There's a nugget. Oh, there's a big nugget. Ooh, there's a couple of big nuggets. So, oh, I got stuck on the nuggets. Come on. Come on. There we go. Okay. There we go. That's... What do we got left here? Not much. I don't see any nuggets. Where's the... 
on one. I'm probably on one, right? Right? And I just can't see it because of that. Oh. Oh, there's a nugget right there. Okay. Can't see any. See, I don't see any blue outline anywhere. Climb out of here for now. Okay, what's it saying that's left? 6%. So it's like one tiny freaking nugget somewhere. I need to pop that because. Ugh, okay, so I don't want to leave that because maybe I need the cobalt. Because if I pop that, it might rain a. A meteorite down somewhere that's easy to get. So I kind of want to pop that. So I'm just going to sink down here. I'm having trouble seeing it with the HV, so let's just pop out for a second here. And then what we do is oh, did I have not have the O2 going in here? That's pretty derpy. There we go. Turn the turrets back on. And we'll fill all there. Okay. So there we go. Let's get our drone. And we'll equip it with the drill. We should be able to... Yeah, there's the nuggets there. See, I just couldn't see it with the... Properly, I couldn't. I was, I guess, right on top of them, and it was just, it was just difficult. You can see, just to get one of them, it is quite a bit slower with <laughs> the hand drill. So if I hadn't seen that with the HP, it would have been just boom. I would have already had that and had three others too, right? So it's... Wow. That's so much faster with the HP. Okay. So did that pop it? Did that pop it? I don't think it did. I didn't see the pop... Like it, it was popping before on the last nugget. Kind of like what a what a meteor used to do, you know? If you guys ever, if you guys have ever popped a meteorite that's fallen on a planet, you know what I'm talking about. Uh, okay, I can't see any more nuggets, and there's no longer a yeah, there's no longer anything indicating that there's anything. So I guess I did pop it. Okay. Okay, well, let's uh, let's take a look to see what we got here. Go into my hover bo or my uh, cargo box, and 802 there, and another 60, so 862 off that. Okay. Okay. Well, that's gonna give us what we need to make a whole bunch more missiles, at least, right? I think. Let's go see. So, ammo is not the easiest thing to put together anymore, which is really cool. I, I like the fact that I'm, I'm kind of struggling, even though I've got like some uber gear, I'm struggling to maintain it with, with ammo and stuff. It's, it's really cool. I like that concept. You can't just like, you can't just sit on what you've done. You gotta keep, keep working. You gotta keep mining. You gotta keep going out and and, and working to, to keep all your stuff running. So kudos and and also auto miners. That the change in auto miners is really good. And, oh, you know I should go out and lay down some auto miners. I don't I don't really want to on this planet though. I'd rather put it on some Neo and Sath to tell you the truth, or maybe some Arrestrium and Zascosium. Uh. Well, we got our cobalt, so let's just... I 
I should have put this in the fridge while I was... Well, we'll eat, we'll eat one anyway. I'll put it in the fridge now. Let's just jump out. And... Oh, right, I forgot to turn my oxygen off first. Is that going to be an issue every time now? Really? <sighs> okay. I guess it's because I keep my thing open. Yeah, okay. Okay, so if I close that, maybe it won't do it. And that's some weird flickering there, but that could be just because I've turned down a lot of stuff to try and make the, the, the game run smoother. Uh, okay, uh, well, what does the ammo this one does? Let's plink this in here, see what we got going on here. Missiles, missiles, missiles. Give me missiles. Yes, yes, many. We want it's a thousand fifteen because my HV needs them too. Ugh, just need, I need to go crazy. Make 600 batches of five or of five yeah so three thousand that's fifteen hundred per vehicle that should be that should tide them over quite a while I don't think I'll have enough um, cobalt let's see how much will that cost cobalt cobalt only five promethium five wow it's gonna eat up a bunch of promethium too yep so, yeah, you can see it's just really expensive to shoot missiles now. <laughs> I like it. That's cool. That's very cool. Okay. Yeah, it's plugging away at it. Although, yeah, I've only made, yeah, wow, this is going to be expensive. I'm going to run out of cobalt. I don't know where to get more cobalt. I guess from the other, I gotta go smash the drone base. Or realistically, I should just, I should fly around the ring now and try and find the cobalt uh, asteroid and mine it with the CV. I think that's what I'm gonna do. Now that I've got some cobalt and I'll have some for my ground stuff. Yeah. Yeah, let's let's close the hatch here. So we we got one small stack of cobalt. Or well not a well not a full stack of cobalt or anyway, but you know, that'll translate into about sixteen hundred ingots, which which is enough to build a decent supply of ammo for both my vehicles right now. Still a little disappointing. Uh, the cobalt is getting hard to find here, so I was hoping it was going to actually force a meteorite to rain down from the sky when I popped it, but it didn't. So that means I got to find another one. Yeah, it tells me. I mean, I swear that I've popped two cobalt deposits now. At least on this planet. Or on this moon. Hmm. Okay. Well, I need to find the other one. I really need to find the other one. But I think going out to space might be a better idea. Where else? I mean... Muscatoon... Has cobalt on it also. And I smashed the, I smashed the CV, the, the, the planetary vessel. Huh. You know what, let's head back there. Absolutely, let's head back there. We're going to power this guy up and head off. Okay, so we're going to need gravity. We'll uh, fill that, fill that. Oh, we got to go in and fill that. So, oops. Let's, uh, come on. 
It is fuel. We'll grab one of these stacks and fill this guy up. Okay. Let's head up into space and go back to, to Oskatoon. I mean, realistically, that's probably the planet where I should be camping right now with the with the Arrestrium potentially falling as meteorites eventually. And some more cobalt. Uh, I can go smash POIs there and maybe kill the drone base and then own own Oskatoon. It it's got a breathable atmosphere. And it's got that 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 racetrack mission thing or that race mission rings warp thingy. So yeah. Okay. Did I... Oh, do you lose your... Yeah, huh? Okay, okay, well, it was locked. Okay, so now it's down there. Did it? Did I just not see it before? Is that? Is that what it was? I love how instant my CV is like instantly at 90. Boom. <laughs> this thing's a plus watch. I just hit W and 90. Love it. That's why I spawned this thing. And even sideways, it's like pretty darn good for a CV. Pretty darn good. For a full combat CV, anyway. Mind you, it can't take the blows that some of those guys' CVs make. Uh, where are we going? Wait, I'm not I, I'm not going in here all the way and then warping. I'm going to Oskatoon. Is it Oskatoon? Oskatoon, Oskatoon. Okay, that's what I'm gonna say. Oskatoon. Okay, here we go. Back to Oskatoon for some rare ores, which I've already sucked out of the orbit. Yeah, I know. And there is no moon, but I took out the planetary vessel. So, uh, I think we need to go take out the platform and some other stuff around it. And yeah, what I'll do is I'll probably take my SV around and scout out the surrounding area. I'm just going to aim my SV kind of into the asteroids a bit so that it has a broader area where it can shoot from. I just can't remember if stuff comes out this far. Realistically, I should land. I should just land. I... I don't think there was much to uh, mine out here because I think I did with the other CV. So yeah, let's find a little island to land on, I think. Somewhere where it looks like there won't be anything else around it for quite far. So we want to kind of find an island in the middle of nowhere. Peninsulas, well, I mean, maybe a peninsula. We'll see. And there's a small island down there. There's some other ones over here. So let's let's take a look. There's one there. Isn't it? That's yeah. That might not be viable up there. Uh, there's an island, a big island there. Don't necessarily want a big island, but let's come down on top of water and we'll take a look to see if there's POIs right there. Whoa. Okay, come on. 
wood. So, don't really see any POIs right there. Okay. Oh, wow, I'm right on the... <laughs> did you see that? I came down in between the... Wow, how did that not crash me? Wow. Like, seriously. Okay, so that's the... That's the abandoned uh, mine, right? That we found before. Okay. Yeah. So iron, promethium, cobalt's over there. So there we go. We got some cobalt over there, somewhere here. What am I saying? And are we gonna blow up? Are we gonna blow up? Let's see. Let's see. So there's a. There's a. An evil base over there, an evil base. And it looks like it'll shoot us. And where was the cobalt? Over there, on the peninsula up here? Okay. Okay, so if there's no shooty guys over here, this might be a good place. Oh, 1800. That sounds really good. Shooty guys, no shooty guys, no shooty guys, okay. Okay. Normally I wouldn't have taken my CV down here, but because I've been here before and smashed the other planetary vessel, it's really not that big of a deal now. So I just want to figure out where a good flat spot is. I could land over on that right there. That would be flatter. Let's bring the HV over. I like this right here. Yeah, this is awesome. And oh, I see something over there that I haven't killed. So that, so we've got a lot of exploring we can do here too. Let's pick a landing. So do I spin it around? Yeah. I know where the drone base is. I think I do. Did I not find that already? Village. Uh, village. It was where all those, it was where the platform was. I can't. Okay. Uh, so none of those POIs marked themselves. Yeah, great. Okay. <laughs> I love it when that happens. Doesn't matter. I'll just face it towards that POI. This looks like it's so there's like dude right there. So there are little dudes that spawn on this island. It's okay. Let's maybe we can just squish them. Whoops. Just drift into them. Oops. What am I hitting? Come on. Go up a bit, up a bit, up a bit. Come on. Can I move over now? There we go. There we go. Okay. Now I should... I'll probably just flatten this tree. Whoa, come on. Just flatten the tree, right? It shouldn't hold me up. It should just explode underneath me. And there's critters right there, so there are critters on this little island. Uh, not a big deal. Not a big deal. We can deal with them. But that'll be for another episode, guys. So here we are on Oscatoon. I think to finish off the episode, the series, what I'm going to do is I'm going to probably smash the drone base on Oscatoon and maybe even loot it, go through as a POI, loot it, and finish off um, this series. That'll, that means I have control of this planet, and, which has just mass resources on it for me to exploit. Uh, so at this point, if I smash the drone base on this planet and loot it, I, I will 
call myself a uh, uh, conquering the game at that point because this is one of the end game planets so we'll see you guys next time uh, is going to be the finale for this series it's going to be me smashing the drone base it's going to be me looting it <clears throat> and uh, basically taking control of the planet and the universe at that point so and well it's just kind of expected it because I could do it on Oskatoon, I could do it anywhere, right? Right? Even with more resources and better gear. So, you know, it's a no-brainer. Uh, at this point, I have only got 111 kills. Because I haven't been really aggressive going out and killing stuff. This has been more of a resource hunt. Uh, step up to the next level sort of series going through the stuff, the new stuff that we got from Seven. Uh, I didn't really do any of the customization, planet customization stuff, and I might look into that in, in my next series because that's where I'll have the opportunity to really apply that. So uh, until then, guys, it was great. Uh, we'll see you in the finale. Have yourselves a good one.